lot number 201 is a 2008 safe boat Archangel. This is a special boat. It's called, it's made by Safe Boat. It was owned by the Brower Sheriff's Office. This vessel is amazing. It's 42 feet long. And it, uh, it's been, re it was, re the mortars were rebuilt in 2018. Uh, ever since it's been sitting outside and at one period of time the water from the rain water from the rain accumulated in the engine compartment halfway up the engine not totally halfway so the insurance company didn't bother bso didn't bother to get it to try to start it or anything so there, i can't give you any word if it runs or not but it has twin cummings diesel 660 horsepower each turbo diesels i'm going to show you the vessel and the trailers included it's a boat master commercial that trailer is a four axle the, the county paid sixty thousand dollars for that trailer alone so let me show you the vessel it's all aluminum it has the bumpers on the side film uh, foam filled it's not air foam filled and there's a small tear in the back i'll show you but that's a simple fix i thought it was air but it's foam filled so the vessel floats without the foam those foams are used as bumpers when they crash into other boats or drug dealers or whatever they chase out there that is to protect uh the vessel from any hard accidents to protect the officers so it has a new nose as you can see that was placed on there i was told it was replaced in 2018 all aluminum the holes aluminum the cabin is aluminum everything is high grade aluminum as you can see the fins underneath the boat this is a special special vessel okay here's I'm gonna show you the tear on the fabric you can see it's foam filled that's a simple fix but that doesn't af affect the floating it's got twin Hamilton jet propulsion as you can see Hamilton big turbine big 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 turbo jets Let's see if I can show you in there all right, uh, this ladder comes on and off. I'm gonna come up, I'm gonna show you the back first. Look at that. It's 14 feet wide. You would need a wide permit to transport this. We don't recommend that you transport this because you need to check the trailer. We recommend the low boy. It would be safer. And uh, it's nice to avoid incidents and check out the boat thoroughly and the trailer before you try to haul it or put it in the water. All right, we opened the two compartments here. I'm going to show you the engines. Look at that monster right there. Look at this one right here. They're both like twins. They were rebuilt, replaced by grant money in 2018. These engines were installed brand new by Cummings. I'm going to show you where the water, you can see in the sides, the water level I went up. But you see when you go down and you look at the valve cover, it's not, it's not water. You don't see water stains water stain you see it below the head okay but it was fresh water so it wasn't salt water it was fresh water from rain water from sitting here there is no drain plugs in this vessel this vessel is solid there's no draining you gotta have a bilge pump on this thing always on because that way the water will come out there's no other way I'm standing on the center beam These engines, I'm gonna have the specs for you. Here we go into the into the safe house. This is a all heavy grade aluminum. Just wanna make sure I don't fall. Yep. All right, as you can see, it's got a generator, Onan generator down here. Let me see if I can show you. You see, it's right there. There it is. Got an Onan generator. Here's the cabin. This is a special boat. It's got two steps down. It's got the shockwave seats nice roof nice headliner hold on bar it's got the compartment it's got the here's the steering system the jet propulsion system right here this is the throttle and this is the jet propulsion here's the steering wheel it's got a garmin 
It's got the Hamilton Jet, which is the mouse, which controls the system. I heard you need to get that updated and checked out before you launch this boat. It's got a compass. It's got the, like uh, so, like T-tops up there. It's very hot in here. Well, I'm sure it has an AC system because uh, you can't be in here without AC. All right, so here it's got a big screen. It's got the VHF. All these radios. And this one says VEI. I don't know what that is. But I'm going to see if I can find out for you what it is and post it on the website. All right, so here's the front cabin. You got two more steps down. You got two side row seating areas on the sides. You got a bathroom on the right over here. I'm going to show it to you. You got a sink. You got a refrigerator. You got a... It's got all the circuit breaker. Here's the generator switch. You got a switchboard over here. Fuse box, fuse terminal. It's all aluminum. This vessel is solid. And here you have an exit door, which is locked. I couldn't open. Here you got racks where you can put things in your compartments there. I don't know what's in there right now. I see movies. Yep. Over here is a combination lock. That must be for weapons. And uh, here's an AC vent. So it does have AC. So uh, I would show you the front, but that's locked. And uh, let me see what else I can show you. It's got these sliding doors on the sides. You could open this up. Let me show you the nose. It's got the Garmin radar in the front. It's got a seating area, two seats in the front. Uh, this is really a special, special military grade boat. This is a special vessel. This vessel was close to a million dollars when new, I was told. And uh, here's the engine. That manual's gonna go with it. I'm gonna provide you whatever they give me. Here's a box full of stuff. It's a 42 footer, okay? 42 footer. All right, and the trailer is amazing. It's a four axle trailer. Uh, I'm gonna take pictures from all angles because I need to cut this video already. It's getting too long. And uh, we're gonna set up a, a special date. Those of you who are really serious about seeing this boat, I'm going to see what date I can coordinate, but only for serious buyers. I don't want to waste my time or your time, so only serious buyers, okay? And uh, uh, I'll let you know. All righty, so that's pretty much it. Good luck.